participating in sports is routinely recommended, keeping fit can be seriously bad for your health. Almost 700,000 Brits are injured annually undertaking sport or exercise. Some types of activity are obviously riskier than others, but even the simplest of sports do a decent amount of damage. Silly boys. Statistics show that in any given year, approximately two-thirds of runners will sustain an injury. The most common are sprains, where a ligament holding bones together is torn, and strains, where a muscle or tendon is torn, twisted or pulled. Accessorising any activity raises the injury risk. Over 3,500 people ended up in A&E after being struck by or striking against sports equipment. And gym bunnies, be warned! Exercise machines, punch bags and even mini trampolines hospitalise substantial numbers. Treadmills are especially problematic. Before use, always check laces are properly tied and ensure any headphone cables aren't going to catch anything. And keep kids away. Children and gyms don't mix. Each year in the USA, over 3,000 kids are injured on treadmills, a third of them while supervised by adults. Pumping iron has drawbacks. Overstraining with heavy loads can cause hemorrhoids. And if dropped, they can smash the feet or even leave the user pinned to the ground. In fact, annually, almost 5,500 weightlifters are wounded working out and only ever use weight to develop appropriate muscles. In 2009, a Californian man was hospitalised after attempting to increase the size of his penis by attaching a dumbbell ring. Oh, my. The homemade enlarger ballooned his member to three times its normal size. But firefighters had to perform Operation Free Willy, releasing him with a power saw. Fortunately, or unfortunately, the swelling was only temporary. Back to the drawing board. 